Praise the Lord. Now, so, but the problem is how do we start? We are looking into these small details today. How do we start? The first thing is with our attitude. What is that attitude required? That is to practice constantly faith in all things. And then we become faithful like Jesus. Now, when we use when we use all that we have, our faith grows. So God wants hundred percent, not ninety nine percent. Correct. Praise the Lord. Now it is through faith God said, when you ask in prayer, you will receive. Yes. Yes. So that is like a muscle. The faith is like a muscle. Yes. Now. Another example, now we, we need to get a little bit deeper. So another example. So think of faith as a muscle. More you exercise, it will build and it will grow strong and you will receive. Second example, we can, we have to think faith in terms of seeds. Jesus gave the example of mustard seed. Am I right? Yes. And when we plant those seeds, did he say there will be harvest? Yes. Amen. Amen. Just as Mary, Mother Mary said, be done according to your word, that word is actually seed. Matthew 13. Jesus says that word is seed. Matthew chapter 13. When we plant that word, Mother Mary gave us Jesus. Now, when we plant the same word, Mother and Jesus, Divine Son, will help us to have harvest. Amen. And, Amen. Amen. And the Lord also said, he said, the more your faith, the larger the harvest. Praise the Lord. 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 And that's how Nehemiah, with that faith, he said, Hanani, you, you, were, you when you heard that news, you were dis in despair. You, you were a priest, but you've fallen apart. But I am going to rebuild. Amen. Amen, amen. Are we praying for that today, tonight? Yes. Yes, yes everybody? Hallelujah. Yes. Hallelujah. I promise, Lord. I promise tonight, the, when you hear this, your life is going to change. Not because I say. Exactly. And you will be, you will be in tears when you see the harvest your life and through you, the life of others. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Nehemiah goes to rebuild the walls of Jerusalem. See that faith. That is the harvest. Now, he, is, he a prof, is he a professional builder? Con no. Contractor? No. 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 He is a butler. So what vision he has? Who gives that vision in faith? Hebrews God. 11, 1. Hebrews 11, 6. By heart this. Imprint this in your spirit. And my spirit. You see the response. See the response of Peter. This is the, another example in the gospel. Peter was, Peter was um, in the same boat with 12 apostles. Am I right? And Jesus walked on water. Are you get, are you right? Yeah? yeah. Jesus walked yeah, yeah, on water. Yeah. Yeah. And then what then there was Tom and Jesus walked on water. And uh, were Andrew, James, John, Bartholomew, were they with Peter in the boat? Yes. yes. Yeah. Are they in the same situation? Are they in the, all together in the same storm? Yes. Yes. Are they seeing the Lord walking on the water? Yes. 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 So what is the re response of Peter? Why is it different than Andrew, his own brother? Andrew wanted the comfort of boat. He was afraid of life. He, he was looking at the storm. Yes? Yes. Yes. And what was Peter? He was caught in the same storm. But Peter said, Lord, if it is you, command me. And I will obey you. I will come out of this boat and step on water where there is no ground for me. 
where's the perfect situation if you despair? And also a perfect situation if you believe in the faith positive. In the faith? Positive. 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 Because faith acts both ways. Negative, because Jesus said, you shall have whatsoever you shall say. What so if you say, ah, this is not going to be possible, then you shall have that. And if you say, yes, it will, then you shall have that. Mark 11, 24. Yeah. So, Peter said, Lord, and Jesus invites us, you and I, to wonderfully walk on this waterless, where there is no ground, where life has no ground. And that's where, just as Peter stepped in boldness, exactly, he, did he walk? Did he walk two steps? The gospel yes. says yes. Yes, he did, yes. Now, you may be, you and I have been in situations and probably in the future would be in situations. I'm not prophesying that, but God willing. And God will also intervene to develop faith. Was Peter's experience different to, say, his brother Andrew? Yes. 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 Andrew was where? In the boat. In the boat. In the boat. In the boat. Did Peter take the risk? Yes. 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 Does life require you and I to take risk in God? Not haphazard, but in prayer. Yes. I'm not saying you go and walk in the middle of sharks, but when situations come through prayer, is it say, Lord, I'm hearing your voice. You're guiding me in prayer. And just as Peter walked, the Lord has the same message for you and I. You and I, Lord has the same message. To walk on when there is no ground. Because Jesus wants us to develop our faith. Amen. 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 Until something is done in faithfulness, it has no meaning to Jesus. Your life, your relationship has meaning is meaningless to Jesus. Now, does is Jesus aware of the pain, the situation, the impossibility that you and I are facing? Yes. Same situation. Yes. 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 But he says, despite all odds, I want you to have faith in. Jesus. Because that is his plan for us. Amen. 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 That is his plan for us. Yes. And do you know he wants you to think best, not just self-help meaning, but the best as per the truth. Because Paul says every promise, every promise of Bible is yes in Christ. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Now the third thing, the first thing we clearly gave about faith was muscle. Say, I'm growing to go, I'm growing to grow my I'm going to grow my faith muscle today. Say everybody. I'm going to grow, I'm going to grow my faith muscle today. Yeah. I'm not going to throw prayers. I'm not going to throw I'm going to throw prayers. I'm go I'm going into Prayer, I'm going into prayer knowing God's will for me. I'm going into prayer knowing God's will for me. God is going to do the best for me in prayer. And that the Lord is going to do the best for me. The best for me in prayer. That's why Nehemiah said, Let us rebuild. Let us start the work. Let us rebuild. Wow. And you know, chapter 4, verse 4 says, He was ridiculed. Chapter 4 in Nehemiah says, You're a butler by profession, you're not a builder. Secondly, intimidation. San Balat, Tobias, see, intimidation, fear. And that's why Jesus says, Do not fear. And again, they sent him threats. See, whenever you start the work of God, threats increase. Hanani, the priest, who was a priest, he was in despair, so he was out. 
God doesn't want anything who is in despair. No use for him. Nothing. God wants that fire to be ignited through faith. Unless you ignite, Jesus, Luke, Luke chapter 12, 49 says, Jesus says, I have come to this earth and how I wish, how I want to see the fire on this earth. Now this in Corinthians, as we know, God's, God is an all-consuming fire that consumes the fire of greed, which is from hell. That consumes the fire of lust, which is from hell. That consumes the fire of jealousy, which is from down below. So God's all-consuming fire, Jesus said in Luke 12, 49, that's what he wants in you and I. Now, it is in, is it when you walk in faithfulness, is it in God's interest? Yes. 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 Praise the Lord. Yes, that's right. Now, the third thing, the second thing we said, seed, mustard seed, in Jesus' own words. And Jesus said, when you sow those mustard seed, there will be a harvest in your life. The proportion depends on how much faith you come before God. The third category that we are going to listen to is the spiritual bank account. So imagine as you deposit money in the natural, you're deposit, depositing the blessings in the supernatural. Now, this is the way. Once we identify a problem in life, say, suppose everyone imagine a problem in their life. Imagine it. Don't be afraid. Come on. Imagine. There are more than one problem in everyone's life. Yes? Yes. 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 So imagine now. Step number one. Second. Verbalize its remedy in advance through faith. What? Second is? Verbalize its remedy. Verbalize. Yes. Verbalize. Say. Vocalize. Verbalize. Yes. Say if you are if you are afraid of an exam, or if you are afraid if you are say uh, a relative is addicted to drugs, or if you are having uh, illness, or mental illness, or spiritual illness, which is anger with God, for example. Verbalize that this person or my sickness, my career is going to I'm going to be delivered. I'm going to be set free. Verbalize the remedy. Because unless we are confronting in faith, you are not exercising faith. There won't be any growth. You'll remain constant and stagnant. And go down here. God wants us to grow muscle, grow our spiritual bank account, right? I want to fill. Say everybody, I want to fill my spiritual bank account today. I want, Amen. I want to fill. I want to fill my bank account. That down and over the flow our spiritual bank account. Today. Everybody, I want to fill my spiritual bank account today. I want to fill my spiritual bank, bank account today. today. And not only that, I want to add interest every time on that. I want to add interest every time. Every time in the name of Jesus. Now, the third thing is to remove fear from that situation. Because God has not given us the spirit of fear. fear. Amen. So remove fear from that situation. Remove fear. Yes. Now, and then what? Don't keep it vacant. Replace that with hope. That is the warfare hope. That is the warfare hope which Paul talks about in Ephesians 6. Helmet of salvation. Salvation in that situation. Because Christ is alive. Yes. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord, Jesus. Praise the Lord. And then you see the Spirit of God working together with in conformance with the word and the deliverance 
is the blessing, the answer for the prayer is definitely on its way. That is what the Bible says throughout the Bible. Nehemiah said, God, you are the Lord who keeps all your promises. And therefore, I'm not going to have my profession in block me in doing your will to completion, to success. I'm not going to have create obstacles in my mind. I'm not going to have those threats stop me from doing that. But see, Nehemiah was not merely praying. You see, he planned against every chance he had. You may be in a situation where there is no hope. But you maybe have, have a longing for that. Tonight, not only because of my good wishes, I don't believe in good wishes. It's only in truth. Because of God's truth, because Jesus said, I am the truth, John 14, 6, because that person of truth who is alive, that deep longing, yearning that you may have for years, that's going to come true. You see, 14 years, I was walking on the road one, one day, and for 14 years, this person was married, but there was no child. So, Whenever I was walking through, and this was eight, nine years back, I was praying, I was praying to God, God, please, I, I want a child for that person. Because it is 14 years. Now that person didn't even know that I was praying. It was not, not even related to me. Someone else. But just on the way to attend mass, and I would see, pass through that house, and I would say, Lord, Please. But nothing happened. So I was passing through six months, seven months. And I said, what's happening? One day, I just went into that house. And I knocked at the door. And I said, Merlin, that lady's name. Merlin, can we just pray tonight? So Merlin said, yeah, yeah, sure, come. So we went with Merlin. And I said, uh, where is the altar and the house? I want, we, let's pray together. So we prayed and I just prayed, Lord, you said in John 14, 14, 14, 13, 14, 12. Wow, this is true. If you ask anything in my name, I will do it. Lord, I, and in Matthew 18, 3, 18, 3, unless you come before God like a little child, you cannot enter the kingdom of heaven. So Lord, I come as a child. I bring down my pride, whatever, lack of faith. And please bless this um, Merlin with a child. So after that prayer, we walked out. And I didn't say anything. The next year, next year, she came and said, she has, there is a good news and uh, the baby is on the way. And now that child is nine or 10, 10 years old. Nine, eight, yeah. So amazing. See, faith as a mustard seed faith. So that, where to sow? In the heart. Where do you sow seed in the natural? In the soil. We are made of soil. Right? Genesis 1. Perfect. That's why, thank God, we are not made of silver or gold. Because <laughs> we, we can't sow seeds. We can't sow seeds. Right? Yeah. And see, seeds, when we sow, God says there will be harvest. In proportion to your faith. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Now, what happened with Nehemiah? We, we will we'll go, but there was new strategy and new plan, new resistance overcoming. Those who have faith, First John says, you are overcomers. First John 4 says, Lord, who is greater is in you than the wicked who is in the spirit. In the, world. the evil spirit is outside, but the Holy Spirit who is greater, the third person, and 
fullness of the whole deity, Godhead, is in us. Now, what happened with Nehemiah? He used this principle. He exercised his faith. He got results. He grew in faithfulness. He started just like Peter did, walking on water. Because God says, human beings, whoever they are, will let you down. Only God is good, so hold on to God. Because he said, I will never let you down. I will never forsake you, even for a moment. Amen? Amen. 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 Now, what happened with Nehemiah? See, the last point we want to know about Nehemiah is, there is and this is very important, there are two points. One point is they went halfway. So they were excited. They went halfway. 50%. Bible says 50%. Then, what were they doing? Building the wall. Yeah. Right? Yes. They were rebuilding, correct? Rebuilding and the then wall. what happened? An internal confusion came. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Uh, confusion. Confusion is where the devil is present. Is Fallen angels are around you there. Yes. Okay. That doesn't mean you are doing something wrong. But that's the reality. And they'll throw more confusion and confound you. Confusion came. Bible wants us to learn this. Confusion. Not clarity. And what happened after confusion? They got angry between themselves. And then they started playing. In their mind, the thought process spiraled downwards. Negative. Faith in the negative, then what was the result? They said, we are going to give up now. Stop this work. Look at the rubble. Look at this confusion. Look at this mess. And that's how they started. They were excited. They were also excited when Nehemiah pumped that hope. 50%, 50% of the work done, they want anger, confusion. Are these things normal? Yes. Yes. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Then what happened? Did Nehemiah give up on them? No. Oh, I'm tired. I'm wanting to give up. No. No, sorry. That's not what he was going to do. Threats from Saint Ballot. Second. Confusion and internal problems. Third, they want to give up. So what did Nehemiah do? He says again, he took this cause of rebuilding and went to God in prayer. 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 And then he said, let us start. And then they started again. And then they started again. Now, second Another point, last point. Now they were building this wall from one end to the other. 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 And one end of Jerusalem, they started, they started <clears throat> getting afraid. And the, they came, the report came to Nehemiah. And they said, no, we can't go on. He said, what happened? <clears throat> what happened? He said, we are constantly this is the area closer to the territory of the enemy and these people they come all the time and they say no we are going to bring it down again they are going to destroy and that's what they heard and that's what they started believing and then they actually started acting and then they said to nehemiah we are not going because this is what we are hearing. We are down. He said, okay. Then he took again that situation into prayer. And what did he do? He said, let's have a strategy, a practical strategy in spiritual way. He said, you, why don't you take in one arm the weapon and the other arm, use your whatever skill you have. See, there were no skills. There were people, ordinary people, volunteers. And he started lay it, build this wall brick by brick. Amen. 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 There is no shortcut to hard work. 
one hand to defend against the enemy one hand to build praise the lord praise the lord praise the lord, hey, lord you have given me these two hands one hand to take the word of god the sword of the spirit and defend against the enemy and the other hand to to continue rebuilding my family to continue rebuilding my profession to continue rebuilding my life amen Amen. Amen. See, ask God today, what do I need to rebuild today? What do I need to rebuild today? What burdens are making me weak today? Amen. Yes. yes. Burdens are making God me weak. will make you eager to rebuild. You and I both. Hallelujah. 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 Yes. See, God's will is not for you to give up like Hanani gave up. Fight the spiritual battle like Nehemiah with your knees first. He came down on knees. He expressed sadness because it was right. But he did not remain in that state. He moved in faith. This is faith. When we say what is faith, this is faith. We understand the definition of faith through the demonstrated life of Nehemiah. Amen. 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 Now, and finally, the result the was miraculous. In 52 days, in record time, Nehemiah built the walls of Jerusalem. Jerusalem. Tonight, let us pray that we are going to rebuild the walls that Whatever brick by brick God wants us to break, we are not going to, you know, walk in helplessness. We are going to walk in faith, faith that rebuilds. Faith. Hallelujah. 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 Let us, let us, let us have, let us close our eyes because we are going to get results. We are going to walk in faithfulness. Yes. We are going to build our spiritual muscle yes we are going to think best in the worst situations Amen. in those situations especially the challenges where your heart is longing and yearning take that desire right now to god in prayer Amen. in miraculous faith remove fear replace with hope use the weapon to rebuild brick by brick Start planning through prayer. Start expecting and anticipating like Nehemiah. And just like not only the wall was built, the wall was built in record time in 52 days. A Hindu tried this same situation when he got Jesus, Satish Kumar, in, he built Calvary Temple in Hyderabad. Now this day, it's, I think it's Hyderabad, we are Telangana now from Andhra Pradesh. And in the midst of this opposition, he built the biggest temple there. It's actually a church and he has named it Calvary Temple. And he built that in exact 52 days. Just like Praise the Lord. Lord. Just like that. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise Hallelujah. Lord. Hallelujah. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Praise Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Praise God the Father. Praise God the Father. Praise, Praise you, the Holy Spirit. Praise, Praise you, Thank you Jesus. God the Father. Praise Thank you, Holy Spirit. Praise, Praise you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Name of Jesus. Power of Jesus. Cross of Jesus. Blood of Jesus. Sanctify us. Praise God the Father. Praise the Holy Spirit. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Worship you, worship you. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Praise you, Jesus. Hallelujah, praise you, Lord. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Praise you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Praise Lord. Name of Jesus, praise you, Jesus. God the Father. 
now we are going to listen a wonderful testimony from sister sheila from our from uk team now sister sheila had wonderful supernatural results from jesus and you know as psalm 139 says your your testimonies and your life is recorded in the book in heaven before you were born John 15 says, Holy Spirit and Jesus come into you so that you testify. And finally, in Revelation 12, this is a weapon. Everybody, you and I must know these days. Revelation, Revelation 12. Because the devil accuses you and I day and night. Accuses. He points out to our failures and weaknesses. So, Revelation 12 says, expand and advance God's kingdom not decrease and step back expand and increase and advance God's kingdom through the word of your testimony and the blood of the lamb so sister Sheila please please take control and share your wonderful testimony take your time and in Jesus. Amen. Amen. Praise you, Jesus. Thank, I want to thank you, my brothers and sisters, my prayer warriors of this prayer group. Uh, I don't know if you remember, I asked for prayers for my mom when she had a fall and broke her hip. And um, she's 84 years old. And the only um, solution for us was to have a hip operation for her at that age it was very dicey it was um it the doctor said you know we have to take a chance to operate her but we did not give up you know because she had a weak heart a weak lung and doctor said i'm giving you the choice to make whether to go ahead with the operation or not because we don't know whether she will come out of it but with faith, we believed and we prayed about it. And we believed that in Mark 11, when he said, Mark 24, whatever you ask for in prayer, believe that you have received it. So we as a family, we prayed. I asked for prayers from the various prayer groups, from my friends, from my families. And we believed that the Lord will bring her through that operation. She went to the operation and she came out of it beautifully without any complications and it was in the peak of covid where you know family was not allowed to go to the hospital to see her so everybody had to go one at a time and it was so scary because it was a covid hospital as well she came out to to the operation she came home and uh, she's at home she's recuperating and um, and nobody, none of our family members also were affected by the COVID. We want to praise and thank God for that. Everybody praise went to the, the hospital, the came back from the hospital without any complications. She came back home and in two weeks, we were all happy that she came back and, you know, the physio was coming home. People were praying for her and uh, she was improving. But within two weeks, my sister got tested positive with COVID. So she had to isolate herself away from my mom. So she was left only with the nurse and her little daughter of 21 years who was looking after her. Within three days, my sister's husband also was tested positive with COVID. So they were in isolation. And then my brother-in-law, my sister got all right, but my brother-in-law Sebi took so bad with uh, COVID. He had to be on a ventilator. He had to be on oxygen. He was in the ICU. 
doctors were giving up on him and said he's a very bad case. Again, I asked for prayers from our various <coughs> groups, from our prayer warriors of this group. And everybody prayed and I really want to thank you for your prayers because I think it was only prayers, uh, offering in prayers to heaven that brought Sebi out of ICU, brought him out of a respirator. Praise and the Lord. After, after, after almost 15 days, he came home. Everybody was surprised how he even came home because he was a very serious case. He had underlying conditions of, um, of um, diabetes and uh, you know, various complications. But he has come home and now they're back home. He's recuperating. He's um, very weak, you know, but I believe the Lord will make him stronger because he's still got a, a lung infection, but he's being looked after very well. He's, you know, God is taking care of him. My mom is being cared for, except that in these days, because my, you know, my mom, for one month, she was not looked after by, and the physio also was not coming home. Uh, her progress stalled and she was, she could not walk and she had just been in bed. Now she's getting bed sores, which is quite painful for her at this time. And I said, Lord, you brought her to the operation so beautifully. You looked after Sebi, you brought him home so well and able to look after mom and my sister and my, my mother-in-law. Now you help her and heal her of her bed sores. And I believe that the Lord will still heal her till we all can be together and spend some good time with her. I really want to thank the Lord. I want to thank Mother Mary, all the angels and saints for looking after her, for praying for her, all the angels and saints. And I want to thank you especially for praying for my mom and for my brother-in-law for everything having gone well. Thank you, Jesus. Praise wow. you, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hands. Amen. Hallelujah. Yes. yes. Thank you, Lord. Beautiful. Thank you. Thank you. Beautiful. So that the Lord says, uh, Sister Sheila, he promises this. The helpless call to him and he answers. He Praise saves, the Lord. saves them Absolutely. from all their troubles. And the psalm, psalmist says, I prayed to the Lord and he answered me. Yes. He freed me from all my all fears. All my diseases. Yes. yes, and he delivers. Yes, that's right. He delivered me from all diseases. And also Psalm 20, especially when you mentioned about source. So the, um, the, the best verse in the Bible for that is, the bed of languishing. We turn to Psalm 41 <clears throat> and look at this verse, this miraculous, mind-blowing verse. Happy are those who are concerned for the poor. The Lord will help them when they are in trouble. And the Lord, because you see, everything is connected with people. Life is connected with people around us. So we are connected. <clears throat> and when we have that right concern, the Lord will help. Second verse. And look at this marvelous supernatural. I see heavens are opening right now over your mom. The Lord will protect them and preserve their lives. Do you believe? Jesus. Believe in the yes, Lord. Lord. And Amen. He will make them happy in the land. Now, the only thing Lord wants us our power to envision this. Yes, Jesus. Look at this. He will not abandon them to the power of death or disease or suffering or wickedness. Yes, Lord. Any yes, Lord. Amen. Amen. Look at verse 3. The Lord will help. So there is guarantee. Not even the insurance claim. The life insurance will guarantee you in all these things. But Psalm 41. The Lord will help them when they are sick. And will restore them. Restore. Will restore them. Will restore them. To help. Yes. Lord, 
pardon my sins and of course as uh, the, the normal way we say is go to confession or ask from god if if not able to during this covid situation and the verse four says be merciful to me show me your mercy lord in this situation oh, and heal me thank you jesus amen and verse 10 so this is the most powerful prayer the psalm 41 for those who are in the bed be merciful to me lord and restore my health so you can pray for mental health emotional health whatever and i will know that my enemies will not triumph for me the spirit of infirmity will not triumph for me and i will know that you are pleased with me praise the lord hallelujah praise the lord praise the lord hallelujah. thank you brother thank you very much thank you for your word i will definitely tell my sister and brother to to say psalm 41 for my mom yeah. and not thank only you. that pray say them that once you pray psalm 41 over few days healing is guaranteed the psalm verse was 3 in psalm 41 says the lord will reverse the bed of languish so whatever your situation is whatever makes you bedridden the lord will cause that to be upside down thank you thank you brother praise the lord wow. praise the lord now um probably we won't go into divine mercy What? but anyone who would like to share any testimonies please Perry, can you say a prayer for Maria's mother? She is still in the intensive care. Yes. Yes, sure. Let us all pray together because yes. you and I. You see, John fourteen twelve says, "Whoever anyone believes in me, yeah, Mel's there, Michelle's there, future prayer warriors are all here. Uh, Linda is here, Pauline is here, Joe, Mr. Elizabeth, Mr. Sheila, Eva is there. So let us all pray together." So Mel sister Mel do you want to lead this you you are also Ah uh, you lead Perry I'll follow you need I'll follow <laughs> Michelle what about you Um what was the lady's name again Yeah Ursulina Ursulina Nunes Ursulina Nunes Michelle yeah All right um we lift her up to the Lord and um pray for healing Yes, Lord. Jesus. Um, Praise you, Jesus. Praise you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, Lord. And I, I'm. We are all there to support you, Michelle. Yes. So the Lord is, as Michelle is opening up, we see heavens are open over this ICU you, bed Jesus. where Jesus. 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 you said in isaiah 53 5 you were crushed for our yeah, iniquities iniquity. you lord jesus yeah, so right. anyone anyone who is in contact with orselina please call her please proclaim proclaim this and decree this that if if she is in a state to confess the sacrament of confession that is most important and that is not blocks the grace so please do that and then when you call them just say that you are healed by the you are healed by the stripes of jesus amen in the name of so whoever now let us do an act of faith here act of trust <clears throat> so let's say matthew 18 19 yes lord says when, you just need one yeah, yeah correct yes that's right when two agree concerning anything our father then, in heaven will grant it to you yes thank you jesus thank you jesus thank you jesus thank you jesus thank you we believe lord jesus we believe that in faith that you will grant us a prayer lord he said when two or three are gathered and pray in faith you will our father in heaven will hear our prayers We believe that you are hearing our prayers, Lord, for Maria's yes, Lord. mom, Arcelina, to yes, give her Lord. your healing, Lord Jesus. Name of Jesus. Pour out your precious blood on her, Lord Jesus, yes, on Lord. every part of her body, 
every part of the organ, of Jesus, every bone, her, every name muscle, of Jesus, her, every blood of vein. By the power Let of Jesus. Lord Jesus, heal her Lord, totally and completely. Yes. Touch her Lord Jesus in your holy right name. Right from the crown of her head to the very soles of her feet, from the soles of her feet to the very soles of her feet, from the soles of her, feet to, the soles of her feet to her head. Yes, Take complete you. control over her body, Lord, because her body is your temple, Lord Jesus. Yes, Lord. Amen. You bless and heal her, Lord Jesus, at this very moment. In Jesus' name we pray. Mother Amen. Mary, cover her with your blue mantle. Hold her in your loving arms. And bring her, Lord. Bring her back home completely, Lord. To give her you give you glory and Lord. Give you glory and honor. And praise to your son, Jesus, our Father in heaven. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. What a wonderful prayer. Yes, Michelle. Yes, Lord. To St. Raphael. Pray to yes. St. Rachel for her healing. Yes, Lord. Yes, Michelle. Yes. Wonderful. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Through the intercession of St. Rachel for her healing. Yes, Lord. Okay. Okay. Amen. Thank, you. Thank, you. Thank, you. Thank you, Lord, that you are healing her now. Yes, Lord. Yes, Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. Jesus. Heal, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Praise 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 Jesus. And yes, for, yes and wonderful. Her, and for her daughter as well, and anyone that's worried about her. Yes. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Bless, thank you. bless Maria, Lord. Yes. You give her the grace, Lord Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Michelle. Wonderful. Praise the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Praise the Lord. Now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Amen. So, uh, Sister Shamili, please call them and just decree this just proclaim yes. and if we can go to sacrament of confession tell her we all have prayed yes name of jesus. Yes. Name of jesus. Yes. and by the stripes of jesus declare healing over her praise the lord praise the lord jesus thank you jesus praise jesus thank you very close to her yeah, thanks wonderful prayer. anyone else uh, I, 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 oh. Yeah, sorry, sure. Sorry. sorry. Yeah. Sorry. Yes, yes. Who's going first? Because Paddy, I, uh, I would like you to please pray uh, for my mom. Her right hand, uh, you know, is bandaged because uh, it's paining, and also she too also has a small bed sore. Sure. Sure. Yes. yes. So now we turn to Psalm six. Wherever there is pain with bone. When, if you're worn out, this is a miracle prayer. It says, I'm worn out, Lord have pity or compassion. You know, Jesus had compassion in Matthew, Mark, Luke, John. He touched the leper. He, he touched uh, the coffin of the widow's son in name. In the morning, you see, uh, in Psalm 6, Verse 2 and 3 says, Give me strength because I'm completely exhausted and my whole being is deeply troubled. Trouble, yeah. Yes. And come and save, save me, Lord. In your rescue me from death. death. So, this another translation says, My bones are trembling or in terror. So heal my bones and have mercy on me. So right now we release this marvelous anointing of Lord. And please jump in, uh, in, in this session. Not only me, but everyone has the, the weapon. So please, right now in prayer, Lord. Barry, her name is Paula. 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 We, release, we release total healing on Paula. Yes, yes Lord Jesus. Bless her. Lord. Transformation. In the name of Jesus. All the shy like shivel and I hear a hear a name of Jesus right now. Thank you. Spirit praise which is the control of this situation. Name of Jesus for the power of Jesus. Name of Jesus. The name of Jesus. Bow down and lift my trumps. Name of Jesus. And let pray in tongues also for us. Let us. Pray in tongues for one minute, everybody. Because, because, First Corinthians 14, St. Paul says, those who pray in tongues, 
say in tongues, talk in tongues, sing in tongues, those who do that, they do not talk to between themselves, but they talk directly to God. Oh Romans God. 16 and 17, Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit himself yes. intercedes, that it becomes a prayer of himself, Spirit of God. Yes. And then Paul says why this is important, because in the New Testament, Paul, one of his letters, St. Paul says, when I was taken to the third heaven, the highest heaven, I heard unutterable utterances that were unutterable. So that is what we so let us come into the spirit right everybody get into the spirit and praise god hallelujah Oh, hallelujah, by the power of Jesus, take away, Lord Jesus, all that is evil. Take away, Lord Jesus, name of Jesus and the power of Jesus by the blood of Jesus by the glory of Jesus amen and healing and grace and mercy Amen. Name of Jesus. Shola Lai. Thank you so much for praying. Thank you. We tear them apart in the name of Jesus. Amen. Praise the Lord Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Cancel the plot of devil. We cancel the Yes, Lord Jesus. Everything, all his burning arrows. Lord Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Praise you, Jesus. Come by your Lord. Come by your Lord Jesus. You said, Lord Jesus, when two or three are gathered in my name, I am there with you. Yes, Lord Jesus. We believe in the name of Jesus. We believe in the cross of Jesus. Come by your Lord. Come by with the wind of the Holy Spirit. Yes, Lord. The power of the Holy Spirit, touch Paula, now Sabina, and all of all people who are suffering in the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord Jesus. One touch from the Lord of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus of Nazareth, Lord Jesus. One touch from Him, and they will be healed. In the name of Jesus, we believe, Lord Jesus, that you are the they are the, the King of Kings, Lord Jesus. You are the ruler of all the rulers. You are the light of the world, Lord Jesus. And Father, Jesus enters, the power of darkness will depart. Jesus, the Holy Spirit, the fire of the Holy Spirit will touch into the heart, into the souls, into everyone who seeks the Lord Jesus. Yes, Lord. We believe in the Holy Thank Spirit, Lord Jesus, Thank right Jesus. now, Lord. We come to you. We come to the throne of the Lord Jesus. We come to the power of the Holy Spirit. We come to the glory of God the Father in heaven. 
and we bow to you jesus because you are only hope your only salvation and nothing is impossible for you jesus yes lord jesus we believe in the lord jesus Yes, Lord. The King of Kings, Thank you. the light of the world, every darkness will depart. Praise the Lord. Praise you, Jesus. Shalai, Shivalalai, Shindrabalai, In the name of Jesus, touch each and every unholiness, Lord Jesus. Nothing is impossible for you. Amen. Praise you, God the Father. Praise you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Praise the Lord. Amen. Hallelujah. Name of Jesus. Shivalalai. Shivalalahiya. 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 It is important that we exercise the Amen. So sorry, man. You had Oh, yeah, yeah. I'd, I'd like to pray for the conversion of my sister. She's, um, she's, um, she's yeah, in a bad way. And uh, I just pray her name's Shauna, that she would, um, that she would, the Lord would bring her back like the prodigal son out of the pig pen and, and home. And can I, can I please ask for the um, same grace for my sister as well, please? Yeah, for all of our brothers and sisters. Yes, yeah. yes, yes. What's your sister's name, Michelle? Uh, Teresa. 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 I have Shauna. And Teresa. Now, again, oneness of mind. Oh, and Dinah. Dinah and Annie and Bettina and Ali for, for Dom's sisters, yeah. Dom's sister. Yes. Okay, sure. So, Shauna, Teresa... Uh, Diana, Katrina, Katrina, yeah, Annie. Okay, now these precious souls, the Lord is going to touch tonight. Now, we, we need to envision this. We need to, Lord says oneness of mind and oneness of heart. Right now, in this moment, if you are thinking about Teresa, uh, Shona. Katina, Ali, Diana. Now, if you're thinking about these souls, our brothers and sisters, right now, and if you're envisioning, that's what one is. That's what agreement is. That is the mind and then the heart. And then the Lord says, the heaven above. Then he will be able to open heaven. Hours of blessings will come. And just as we all have prayed for others, the same spirit is going to work into their lives from this moment. Thank you, Jesus. I agree. My heart. Raise your right hand. Praise it, Jesus. Now, Lord Jesus, we bring these souls to the throne of grace. Lord, you said in Hebrews 4, 16, mm -hmm. the promise of this word, and mm -hmm. therefore the Spirit acts in the confirmance of the word, that when we come with boldness of our heart, and when we come with awesome faith like this, not this much, when we come this with boldness of heart, and when we say, whatever spirits, whatever evil spirits that have taken hold of our lives, of their lives, Right now, we come against those and we break the power of the devil right now in Jesus' name. This Jesus. moment, under open heavens, through the Blessed Mother and through the protection of St. Michael and all angels, when all miracles have happened, when all conversion stories have happened in the world, it is, it is always through those who have prayed. Yes. And the Lord has now or in future has Thank always Jesus. answered those prayers yes, and Jesus. touched those lives. And yes, Lord Jesus. Jesus. In Jesus' name. Mm -hmm. John 8.36, we decree right now. This Thank world you, Lord, is actually Jesus. 
released through fire of God right now. Don't do this. What is released? Don't do this. 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 Hallelujah, hallelujah, you will be free indeed. You are free indeed. indeed. Yes, Lord that Jesus. Is the word we are going to hold on. And they are Thank you, Jesus. Set free, Lord Jesus. Set free, Lord Jesus. Bless the Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Jesus, hallelujah, hallelujah, Jesus, praise the Lord, thank you, Lord Jesus, hallelujah, hallelujah, Jesus, thank you, praise the Jesus, hallelujah, hallelujah, Jesus, it's this special mercy and then Lord Jesus, hallelujah, pray for sharing, Lord, pray for sharing, praise the Lord Jesus, find them, Lord Jesus, what is bound in heaven will be bound and not Lord. You touch them, Lord Jesus, and bring them on the right path, Lord Jesus. All, together, all of you and I, find their hearts. Find their hearts. Find their souls. 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 Jesus. Through Jesus. Through the yeah. Son who sets them free. Amen. The Son who sets them free. And they are bound in heaven to Jesus. And right. they are bound in heaven in Jesus' name. Thank you, amen and amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. From this Thank very you. moment, we yes. don't have to see them, not through the physical eyes, but through the eyes of the natural. That this eyes are seeing. These eyes are seeing Teresa. These eyes are seeing Donna. Completely changed. Amen. 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 Praise you, Lord. And and um, can, can I say, I, can, I, can, sorry, can, I just, sorry, you go first. Yeah. Can we just pray the, the conversion prayer that Jesus said to Saint Faustina? If we yes. just say it three times, or um, and it's O blood and water, which gushed forth from the heart of Jesus as a fount of mercy for us. For us. We trust in you. We trust in you. O blood and water, which gushed forth from the heart of Jesus as a fount of mercy for us. We trust in you. O blood and water. Which gushed gush forth from, from the heart, heart of Jesus, of Jesus. as a fount of mercy for us. Mercy for us. We, trust we trust in you. you. You see, the same Emperor Arthur Zaxi's heart was changed because Nehemiah's faith. The cruel emperor who chopped the heads of anyone who opposed that heart was changed. Anyone thought. So we believe, we trust those race, those blood and race. Katrina, Katrina, Ali, Shauna. They are being purified by the blood of Jesus, by the rays of Jesus. Amen. We just need to believe. And Jesus will do the rest. Amen. Amen. Do you know what I just saw in the spirit? I just saw Jesus, the blood that is very happy with that prayer and that, and happy with this group. Yes. But, and that the blood and water was like the mortar between wow. the bricks, you know, in the building and the, and the bricks were the, the, the people, the souls of that we pray for. Wow. They were the living stones being built. Yes. And it was the blood and water was the mortar. That um, praise you, Lord, and bless you, and thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Praise you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, Michelle, sorry, yes. Oh, I just had a sense to pray Psalm 111. Would that be okay? Sure, yes, please go ahead. Yes. yes. Psalm 111. I will give thanks to the Lord with all my heart. Yes. In the company and assembly of the dust. Yes, Will I wait? Sorry, will I wait for you to find it? Oh, you want us no, to no, repeat? You yeah. continue, you continue. Just continue. Okay. Great are the works of the Lord, exquisite in all their delights. Majesty and glory are his work, and his justice endures forever. 
He has won renown for his wondrous deeds. Glorious and merciful is the Lord. That's all. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Over our sisters, and yeah, we pray that, um, yeah, that the Lord will change their hearts and change yeah. our hearts to be, um, to have the words to say to them to bring them to the Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes. Because the Lord, you you yourself has said in the word, taste and see that the Lord is good. <laughs> Lord, that taste tonight, this very moment, they are experiencing that. Lord, turn that situation. We take spiritual control of their lives through prayer. You yes, said, yes, Lord, you. Lord, and through prayer, impossible becomes possible. Amen. Through Praise faith. the Lord Jesus. Yes, Lord. Praise the Lord. And as, yes, and as Brother Ryan prayed and Sister Michelle, Mel and everyone, as Michelle said, how wonderful are the things the Lord does. Great and powerful. Lord. Thank you, Lord, this guarantee for this complete assurance without any trace of God that we speak life into their lives. We speak redemption into their lives. We speak yes, Lord. So that Lord, which your righteousness and faithful that is eternal from everlasting past through your covenant and blood power. Lord, grant these graces Amen. in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. Praise, Praise the Lord. Yes, wow. This amazing prayer session that is going on. So we don't, mm. yeah, we don't keep track of time when we are in such fire. Yes. yes. Yeah. yeah, I want to pray for one of my friend. His name is Abai, and um, um, his father um, has been uh, yes. kept captive by his elder brother for the sake of the property and the yes. wealth of the family. Yes. So we ask the Lord Jesus in a powerful way, yes. touch yes. his heart, soften his heart, like the King yes. we heard today. You Let's know, pray for. Yes, sure, brother Ryan. What's his name? Uh, Abai, his uh, Abai. friend's name. Yeah. So this this person, Abai's uh, dad, Father. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Now we see uh, Saint Paul through the Holy Spirit through Saint Paul says, when the time is near, in the last day, the hearts of people will grow cold, be debauchery and licentiousness and adultery and fornication and people not talking sense and behaving in self-centered way. Exactly opposite. This is the perfect case the Lord has brought together in our yes. hands. Yes. Lord, you promised in Matthew 6, Matthew chapter 6, 33, I think, seek the kingdom of God yes. first. That means pray for others and do good in the kingdom yes. of God. And everything ends. <laughs> right now we break the hold of devil. Break the hold of Satan. Every, in the name of Jesus, Nazareth, Shalai, every spirit of greed, of property, of yes. all those touch wicked spirits, all those right now in that are holding him captive. Just as Paul yes. and Silas prayed yes. in. That situation like so many right now. Actually, the Holy Spirit he, he impressed yeah, on that. Yeah. Say, say Ryan to that person. Hey. You need yes, to praise, yes. praise Lord, just as Paul and Silas praised in when they were thrown in the dungeon. Okay. Right. When yeah. they were thrown in dungeon, and what happened? God's uh, angels came. To angels came and Delivered them in that situation. There was a violent earthquake that took that place completely. Oh Lord, shake whatever that needs to be shaken right now. Amen. Name of Jesus. Name of Jesus. Amen. Right now, build whatever needs to be built. Release fire over this situation from heaven. Name of Jesus. Nazareth. Name of Jesus. Authority against Satan and his kingdom. Because all power he has given us. We Take name of Jesus. And touch Lord Jesus. Your paper. Together of our from this captivity. Yes, Lord Jesus. Holy Mother. King of Kings.
Thank you, Mother. Crush the head Praise you, Jesus. Mind. Thank you, Jesus. We love you, Jesus. Touch in the holy name, Lord Jesus. And the power of the Spirit. All glory be to God. In the name of Jesus. If you are having hunger pangs, Jesus is saying. Oh, not. You can't make a smile. That is my mother. Right, right, you must go. From the every word. Oh, you the can't the make, you have to say the deal. Otherwise, anyone else needs to And you'll get put on the roof and get grounded for the rest of your life. What the fool so said? They promise to go to Melbourne. Praise the Lord. Yeah. Praise the Lord, Jesus. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. I just need to go to Taiwan. You don't want. Where do you want to play? That's wonderful, Michelle. Um, um, Mel, that's wonderful. See the voice of Isabella. No, <laughs> no. Sorry, sorry. Could I just say one thing, Parry? In, in, in tonight's in uh, this weekend's gospel reading, it yes. talks about the 10 talents, yes. oh, the five yes. talents and the one talent. Oh, yeah. oh, the, the, the steward that, um, that, that had the 10 talents and had made 10 more, the five made five more and the one that buried it. Yes. Um, the Lord has showed me that the, 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 um, the prayer to St. Gertrude the Great, especially in this month of November, uh, oh, Eternal Father, I offer you the most precious blood of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in union with all the masses said throughout the world today, for all the holy souls in purgatory, for sinners everywhere, for sinners in the universal church, those in our own homes, within our families and those that we love. The Lord showed me this, that by praying, when, when we were eating our meal, having our meal, we said grace. And the Lord showed me um, that who, who nourishes the holy souls in purgatory? And uh, it's, where, where do they get their nourishment from? We, we sit down, we nourish our bodies. And he said, pray for them. It takes 30 seconds. Wow. So every time we say grace... We, um, we say that prayer for the holy souls so that they get nourishment. And then not only are we nourishing them, but we're quenching Jesus' thirst by bringing souls, the thousand souls, into heaven. Wow. That then come in to praise Jesus. I mean, that's a thousand people. Can you imagine a thousand souls in your living room, your room, where yeah. we're all at now? Wow. A thousand people. Praise God. Yes. 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 Praise God. I'm and then, Oh, yes. And then the Lord showed me, he said, um, the Lord showed me like the coin, you know, that that prayer is like a coin yes. and it, it never diminishes in value, but always increases in value. Like the interest, you put a coin in, you put a thousand dollars in, you earn interest. Yes. Well, we, we, we pray that and we're earning intercessors in heaven. Yes. Yes. But, um, but, but also is that um, who prays for the souls in purgatory? Yes. Only the Catholics of the world yes. are yes. the only people. How many Catholics pray for the holy souls in purgatory? Yes. Yeah, wow. and so um, we, are, we are in the position where we are the servant that has been given more. Amen. have been given the 10 coins yes. and that prayer because it is for the holy souls in purgatory yes for the noblest yes that and and we are responsible so the yes. lord showed me just just to just to pray that prayer yes at least at meal times and yes. my husband and i normally we, my husband and i try to pray it as often as we can like i think if i can pray that 10 times in wow. one day that's 10,000 people. An empty purgatory, yes. Yes, and exactly. If, if, if you exactly. say the chaplet, then uh, 50,000 uh, souls are released. 
clothes. Oh, so have a chapter on the rosary, then 50,000 souls are released. Yes, praise God. And praise that God. prayer of Gertrude, that's five minutes. And as Linda said, wow, my, now I'm just, uh, you know, having great joy in my heart that this is, Mel, yes. you should also give uh, a talk on this one day. And Linda, yes, you yes. Can, yes. Maybe we can just say that prayer now all together yes. again, just with that okay. information. Yes, once more. Could, that is, uh, let's say it just once more because yes. Yes. Um, that's once each person. So how many, how many people on here? 10 people at least. That's 10,000 souls. But, but we've all also got to remember that our Blessed Mother said, in heaven, when you pray, if you do not pray from the heart, if it's just lip service, all they hear is blah, 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 blah. They don't hear. It doesn't pierce. It doesn't. It doesn't produce the results. Most so, Corinthians, yes, says that. Yes. Even if you yes. burn your body as offering, you know, people, some some religions or some they burn, but it's, God says that's just clanging singer. Yes, 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 yes. First Corinthians thirteen. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Sure. Amen. Go ahead. Eternal Father. We offer you the most precious blood of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in union with all the masses said throughout the world today, for all for the, the holy, holy souls soul in purgatory, purgatory. For, sinners for sinners everywhere. everywhere. For sinners in the yes. universal so church, church, those in our own those homes, our own and within homes, our families, and, our own families. and those that we love. Amen. 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 Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord, Jesus. I can see things are flying to heaven now. Yes. yes. We believe. We trust. Jesus. Amen. I Amen. Amen. I'll give Jesus a big hand. What a wonderful fellowship. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. To people. That's why Jesus died for all of us. And anything done without the connection of people, anything, even if you're fighting bushfires, Shane, I think Shane Fitz, uh, he was actually giving us a talk. He's the New, New South Wales rural in chief. And he said, in those de devastating moments, uh, I was thinking it's all connected to do with people. It has nothing to do with anything else. It's all connected with people. So, wow, that's that's so much grace being formed. And we are building, growing in faith, in muscles, in your hearing the voice of the Lord. We are seeing the visions of angels, guardian angels, Mother Mary, all heaven surrounding us 24 by 7. Praise the Lord. Okay. Praise the Lord, Jesus. Praise, Praise the Lord. Lord. Bring your. Hallelujah. Always uh, bring all. I'll try to bring more and let this grow. Okay, okay. So, uh, we are all on song and on fire. Let us ignite lives. Amen. <laughs> Amen. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Thank you, Patty. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, bye. Thank you, God. Thank you very much. Yes, thanks, Eva. Thank you. Thanks. God bless. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Bye, Michelle. Bye, man. Bye, bye. Bye, bye guys. And, and thank you so much. Yes. You guys are awesome. <laughs> thanks, man. Bye, 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 Barry and Steffi. Bye, everyone. Bye, 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 bye,